Hey guys, you are welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm going to be showing you all on how I do my natural wash day. So you stay tuned and don't go anywhere. Catch ya! So, hello. For my natural hair, I will be making use of two eggs. You can make use of one depending on how thick your hair is. I'll be making use of my onion, my coconut oil, olive oil, my shampoo, and lastly, my gloves because the onion smells a lot. So all of this, those stuffs I mentioned are what I'll be mixing up for my hair. So I'll just go ahead to peel off my onion. You can blend it if you wish and you can also pound this all you need from this onion is just the onion juice that will be all for this hair so i'll just go ahead to chop this into smaller pieces for easy blending or pounding yeah i know for a fact that eggs smell but then this is not the first time i'm making use of eggs on my hair Eggs are said to keep the hair thick and healthy. Um, the yolk is loaded with healthy fats, which helps replenish moisture and makes the strands look silk and shiny. I have black hairs and I want it to look silk and shiny. So yes, <laughs> I will use eggs over and over again because it's a go-go for me. And with this olive oil, gosh. I keep having much thicker strands of hair each time I make use of it. I'll just set all of those aside and I'll get ready my onion juice which I'll be straining into the cup of egg. This juice, when it's been applied to the hair and scalp, it provides extra sulfur to support strong and thick hair. It also promotes hair growth and it prevents hair loss i would make sure to mix this together properly before i apply them to my scalp and my hair which i'll be showing you guys in a minute So this is what the mixture is looking like after I'm done mixing it thoroughly. I'll just go ahead to part my hair into sections. Now applying this mixture to my hair and scalp as evenly as possible. While I'm applying this, I'll just make my way through with my finger, the tip of my finger um, to the root of my hair. I pull them through and make sure I apply it on every part if that really makes sense. As you all know that onion juice may have some side effects like redness and itching of hair but then when you mix onion juice with an emollient like aloe vera or coconut oil it may prevent your hair from itching which is why I mixed it with a little coconut oil. And this coconut oil stimulates the hair growth and it moisturizes dry hair and fights against lice and dandruff. I love this coconut oil because it adds luster, shine and softness to my hair. Of course, who wouldn't want that? <laughs> okay. So I added olive oil to this because I have slim strands of hair. I don't know if I mentioned that earlier. And I'm aware that olive oil improves the blood flow to the hair follicles. And the follicles are in turn stimulated to grow thicker strands of hair. So yes, I love coconut oil. I love olive oil and I'll say that again and again and again so I really do recommend that you make use of this 
coconut oil especially olive oil whenever you're making use of onion juice so it prevents your hair from itching if that makes sense and of course it does so i'll be leaving all of this in the description box below so you do well to check it out and also do well to check out my other video on how to style your natural hair you can check that in the notification that pops up here I repeated the same step on the other side of the hair. I'm applying the juice from my scalp to my hair using the tip of my finger just to make sure I apply them on every part until I get to the back of my hair. And I don't know if you guys noticed, I've been applying this little at a time on my hair. I'm not applying too much of this that way uh, my face don't get messy or my dress or then my body like I said the egg smells so you should take your time until you are done with this process until you're sure that the juice can go round until it is more than enough <laughs> yeah until it is more than enough then you can apply as much as you want just like I did yeah I know that looks messy so I just cleaned everything off and I wrapped my hair I will leave this to set for like 30 minutes before wash I will rinse my hair and I'm using this mild shampoo to reduce any onion smells so this is it for this video guys if you're new to my channel hello I'm Roxy Styles you're very much welcome to my channel please do also like this video and leave a comment in the section down below and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if this video has been of help to you and do want to check out my other videos and I'll see you guys bye